نحن دائما في مدرسة البكالوريا الأمريكية نسعى لتطبيق ما هو جديد ومطور في مجال التعليم من أجل تحسين مستوى الأداء الأكاديمي في المدرسة عن طريق إثراء المناهج وبالتالي تهيئة أفضل الفرص لطلابنا وطالباتنا وتكون لهم القدرة على مواجهة التحديات في المستقبل قمنا بتطبيق برنامج ستيم ستيم هو اختصار لساينس تكنولوجي انجينيرينج اند ماث استضفنا فريق متكامل من مؤسسه ديسكفري اديوكيشن وحضر خبراء قاموا بزياره المدرسه وقاموا بعقد عده ورش عمل مع اعضاء الهيئه التدريسيه داخل المدرسه لتجسيد آلية مبتكرة للتدريس Here at ABS we are um, hosting Discovery Education and learning more about STEM and the Discovery Education system. It's an online tool that we use. We are also hosting a STEM camp for our middle school and elementary students where it's an after school activity where the students learn about science, technology, engineering and mathematics by building, using their hands, doing virtual field trips, learning about bridges. We're going to start by building bridges, learning about different structures and how they're used. STEM activities engage children on many different uh, levels using the common core standards. Uh, one way is to use children's literature. Uh, take, for instance, the story, the billy goat's gruff. Um, in that story, there are three billy goats that are eating away in a happy pasture, nice and green on one side, and they realize that all the grass is gone. But they get to the bridge, and they realize at the base of the bridge, there's a mean, ugly troll uh, that has a toll. And his toll is that he gets to eat one of them so the other two can cross the bridge. So how do they get across the bridge to the other side of the grass? That is the challenge for the student. Once they've designed the bridge and put it across this make-believe creek, they, can, they test it by putting weights on it to see how much it will hold. Then they have a solution that they present to the rest of the class. Textbooks are there to replace textbooks. Uh, this involves students having an iPad in the classroom and at home. Uh, their iPads are connected to Discovery Education, uh, which is our partner in this. Uh, students can read their textbook. Their textbook is a lot more than just a textbook. It involves videos and other digital content, even interactive games and activities. We've also purchased two 3D Cube Pro printers for use uh, in technology classes as well as other subjects. In the elementary school, we can use this to print specific models for science class, art, um, and, and math. In the high school, we actually have a design project called 3X, where students will go through the entire design process, um, working through the problem-solving skills that they need um, to create a real solution to a real problem. And in the end, students can print out their final inventions using the 3D pin printer. And, and take this away with them. STEM guides and supports children's natural curiosity to explore and observe the world around them, to ask questions, to predict, to integrate their learning, and collaborate with their peers. STEM education builds a foundation by allowing children opportunities to investigate in an area or an idea in a variety of ways. My role is to work on coding with teachers and with students. They're going to be creating code using the product created by Discovery Education in the UK. So we have a coding product that teaches children from grades one through to grade six how to code like professionals. We worked on a whole series of activities on STEM. We trained the whole staff. We worked with a small group of teachers. We helped to support a, fa a family night where people from the community came and were involved in STEM activities. Working with high school teachers has been a pleasure, helping them connect digital technology that is curriculum aligned to improve and help our students integrate these resources as they develop their scientific skills. 
Um, along with being here and working on such a great campus with wonderful teachers, we're really helping our students work towards that 21st century learning opportunity. As we know, the acronym STEM, Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math, deal with some key components that are going to help transition our students into the 21st century and be able to compete in the global economy. With that being said, we look at four STEM indicators. These are critical elements that all students need in order to progress and be successful in this new environment, in this new world. Those are critical thinking, creativity, collaboration, and communication. The goal of this program is to develop the skills of education for our وصقل الشخصية وإيجاد لديهم القدرة على حل المشكلات الصعبة في المجتمع